like forever since I've sat down to chat with you. Obviously we did our Greece vlog, we did our Mallorca vlog, and in between there's been no updates, clothing hauls, Zara hauls, etc. And finally we're back together, you and I forever. So I love doing what's in my wardrobe. It's kind of my way of updating you girlies on life through clothes. So what I've been wearing, what we're loving, what we're hating, trends, everything. We just talk about it all. I show you what I wore on my holidays. We're gonna show you everything that I wore in Greece. Yeah, there's obviously some Zara. I haven't done a Zara, like I haven't done a full Zara haul in a while, of course, pending. But today there is Zara, but this is a bit of everything. It's just a general bikinis, everything. And I always leave links for you below so you can shop or I leave you dupes. I leave you similar items because of course, as we know, things go out of stock so fast, etc. And I do always say I'm typically a UK and stop UK town on the bottom. For size reference, I'm a prox 5253 in height as well. So let's get right into it. I see you in my likes, subscribes, and comments. I appreciate you so much. We can chat below. Ask me anything below. I love chatting to you. And if I don't get back to you below, you can always DM me on Instagram. I always try my best to get back to you there as well. I just love chatting with you. Let's go. Love you. So we're diving right in with Zara, and I wore all these outfits on my holiday. So in Greece, you'll you'll see them throughout the vlog. But in the vlog, I actually really didn't talk about my outfits at all. Listen, when me and Sam are traveling, we're away with fairies. Uh, like I even the vlog, it's chaotic. It's it's all over the place. We're just having too much fun. So I just totally forgot about any outfit info. So here, this is why we're doing this video. So let's start with this beautiful dress. I can't wait to wear this again. That looks like a really shitty green. Okay, anyway, it's a beautiful green. It's a really nice minty lime green. So this first hour dress, I'm obsessed with this. I got little photos, it's actually only in the back of it, but this is the Corfu sunset, it was stunning. And it has a beautiful floral print, really nice cupped boobies. I got this in a size small. I'm gonna be honest, I feel like this is already gone. I feel like these hour bits might already be gone, but I've, I'll of course link them. But I feel like because of the sale and everything, I'm not sure if they're still gonna be there, but I hope they are. I'm going to Lisbon with my girlies, so I'm definitely gonna be bringing this with me. It's so pretty, and it was really nice and light. It wasn't sweaty betty. Corfu was like 35 degrees, it was really warm, but this, it was, it was beautiful. Really cute, so you can wear that with your sandals, your heels, it's a very stunning summer dress. I feel like a lot of people are still yet to go on their holidays, so tell me where you're going, or tell me where you've been. I love knowing where people are going. It's, it's mid-July. So yeah, I think there's a lot of August holidays coming up, so you tell me. And then in keeping with the satin floral dreams is this Zara dress, maxi dress. I'm not a massive maxi dress gal, but last summer I kind of got into them and this summer I was like, you know, we'll, we'll do a few. They're cute, see? And of course, like the TikTok viral dresses. Um, Oh, where are they? I've shown you like the green and pink vial dresses. Where are they? I don't know where they are right now. Anyway, this one is so beautiful. So the straps, honestly, quite annoying. The back, is, it's just a lot to it. Um, you know, it was a struggle to get into. I had to get Sam to like tie me into it, but it's absolutely beautiful. Again, I'm definitely gonna bring this away with me again. It's so pretty, the color. I just love satin, we know this. Satin is my fave. It's just so expensive looking. It's so romantic. It's a... Uh, it's beautiful and that little floral print so cute so i got that in a size medium so again we say this every time i can't explain why or how i got like a small in that but a medium in that but we all know that zara is just like that you could have an extra small and an extra large it's just bizarre so maxi i usually go for a medium anyway that's just how it goes oh my god also obsessed with this someone came out of love island wearing this I saw someone was on a podcast or something wearing this. Isn't this so pretty? I didn't get pictures. Oh my God, I didn't really get pictures in... I didn't really get pictures in, in this. I didn't get pictures in this one. Beautiful. Oh, I'm obsessed with this. I just love that print. Very summer holidays. Cute mini... Like, look how pretty. Oh, I need to wear this and get pictures in it. This, is it a size S? I got that in a size S. So yeah, typically with Zara, I'll do a size S in a mini dress, but a medium in a maxi, because my hips, I always say I'm UK, A on the top, UK 10 on the bottom. So if it's maxi, I'll do medium, so it'll fit the bum bum. No? I love that. I wonder if they have that in other colors. I'd love that in a pink or something. But I'm not gonna lie, I feel like last year's summer, I do think last year's Zara dresses, mm, actually no. I feel like last year Zara had a few better summer dresses, but this one is high up on my list this year. She's she's very pretty. She's very cute. Oh my god, I love this. Okay, I love this. 
this mesh silver glittery dress. It is a bit weird fitting. The back is a very low back, stunning. But obviously it's see-through, so I wore it as like a bikini dress, a, a beach dress. But you could of course wear that for dinner, but it was just, it was very short on me. What size did I get? Probably medium. Yeah, I got a medium in this. And it is short and it's obviously see-through, so it makes an absolutely stunning beach dress, bikini pool day, or it would make a beautiful dinner, but you would just have to wear like your all black underneath it or something. Or white, I think I wore, yeah, I wore it with my white and glitzy bikini. That bikini is from Calzedonia. When I was in Mallorca, uh, when I was in Palma with Sam, you'll see in that vlog, I bought some bikinis and that one I bought in Calzedonia and so cute. I love it so much. So we matched it with that. It just actually matched perfectly. And then when I found this, I also found the top. I think I found the top in oh no did I no I found the top in store I think I'd ordered that and then saw this in store I was like oh my god okay I need it so a small in the mesh top so I was wearing that in the Corfu vlog in Old Town um, and stunning it's so cute so obviously again you have to wear a little bralette underneath that I think I just wore a bikini underneath it but it's really cute even when it comes to autumn winter it'll be cute am I allowed to talk about autumn winter yet no but I love it. You know, you know I love autumn winter fashion here. Autumn winter styling, it's just a lot more fun. But anyway, no, maybe summer's more fun, but autumn winter, there's more to do, I think, because there's more items of clothing. Whereas in summer, we're absolutely sweating. We can barely wear two pieces of clothing without sweating, okay? But super cute. So I'll leave the Zara links below, and what I always do is find some like ASOS dupes, maybe similar. If the Zara stuff is gone, you can still find something similar. It's down below. So let's talk about bikinis. Okay, so I found a new brand and I'm obsessed. It's called Bright Swimwear and I ordered these two. One thing I will say is up a size or two in the boobies because this is a medium. That's a medium cup, which like I can't even imagine what size the small was. Um, oh, I was wearing it also, you know, I love that wearing it with like wearing your bikini upside down i think it's so cute but yeah i would just say up a size in your tops the bottoms were perfect i got um oh i actually got large i actually up to size i always up a size in bikini bottoms just so they're comfy and they're not like cutting into you and i always love bikini bottoms that are a tie instead of one strict band it, i'll always do a tie that way you can adjust it to your shape and your figure and however you like to wear it but i just love these patterns the colors there was so much more i wanted to buy they're stunning bikinis i really loved them and this is the other pattern i got so sorry same pattern but different colors aren't they adorable so obviously floral bikinis are always a good idea they're always popular and um, wearing your bikinis upside down is so cute. You can find all over TikTok like different ways of wearing your bikini tops. Um, and it's so adorable. So I really loved them. Bright swimwear. I think they're Danish. I think it's from Denmark. I don't know why I have that in my head. I think it, maybe it's because it, I on the delivery I saw that it was Denmark. I'm not sure if it's a Danish brand, but anyway, love it. It's European anyway. Then, oh my God, I love this one. Oh, where's the top? So this is Reclaimed Vintage on ASOS. So cute. I tried to link it to my story on Instagram and I couldn't find it online, but then my friend told me she had just ordered it. So I'm not really sure. I'll get the link for you anyway. But um, so you can see that really pretty daisy print. So cute. Again, flowers, always flowers on your bikini, flower on your titties, adorable. And the bottom's there. So cute and it says, Reclaimed Vintage on the back. I'm not sure if you can buy directly from Reclaimed Vintage or they're just on ASOS, but super handy. Oh, and another Reclaimed Vintage is this cute pattern. I thought it was very cute. It's not really tie-dye, but it's some kind of, what would you call that? It's a kind of, oh no, it's flowers. Very cute. Again, I always get the bikini bottoms that are adjustable. I don't want any restricting bikini bottoms. Sorry, this was so annoying. I ordered from H&M and they didn't arrive in time. You know when you order something, didn't arrive in time, so you come home to it. Like, at least I am going away again and it actually, it is a bikini trip, so I'll bring them on that. So I have so many black and white bottoms, but I just wanted new tops. So these are H&M, really cute. I just love these kind of booby, scrunchy type tops. Uh, so they're pretty similar, but ones that's more like a ruched fabric. This is... I don't even know. I'm I, I'm I, I'm not sure 
I don't know. I don't know what's happening, but I'll link them below. They're just very cute, very simple, uh, very affordable. UK 10. How much were they? The price isn't on them, but I, just, I think what I got one of them for like six years. So very cute. H&M is great for bikinis as well. Oh, they're the Calzadonia ones that I showed you. Look how pretty. I will forever cherish this bikini. Uh, where are the bottoms? They, these are the Calzadonia ones anyway that I got in Palma. And then where was I again? Oh, and then in Corfu we passed to Calzadonia and Sam was like, you don't need to go in there. You don't. I did go into Sephora, but I didn't go into Calzadonia, but I, I was tempted. Oh, I want to show you this. Um, myself and Sam went to a wedding. It was such a beautiful wedding. It was Sam's cousin. And this is from Revolve, which, you know, it was expensive enough. And then everyone kind of thought it was a Zara dress, which was like, oh my God, I just spent triple the price. And yeah, yeah, it could have very much been the Zara dress. I wore the pink Zara dress in Palma. And then this was the next weekend. And yeah, they were pretty similar. Uh, yeah, I won't disagree with that. And uh, whatever, okay. I will cherish this, I love this. I just, it's really flattering. The little tie at the back, maxi dress, yeah. Oh my God, this is, I love this. I think I'll bring that to Lisbon as well. <laughs> yeah, very pretty. What's the brand, Bardot? Bardot on Revolve. Bardot on Revolve and size medium. Oh, I love, yeah, I love this. I think the color was called like strawberry. I just love that color. It's a really pretty pink, okay? There we go. I have been loving Urban Outfitters recently and I wore these pants for the airport. Oh my God, I love them so much. So they're, it's France. Is that, am I saying that right? We've talked about this before. Are they Swedish, Danish? Mm, someone tell me, it's, it's France, you know the brand. Oh my God, these cargo pants. I love them so much. I just remembered, did you see my bath mat on my little TikTok? I made a TikTok of, um, a little shopping haul and I'd been to Urban Outfitters a different day and I got the cutest bath mat. It's so cute. Okay, anyway, I'll run and get it now in a sec. But these pants, obsessed. I need them in white as well. Got them in a size medium. Mm, I love them so much. I just remembered, I yeah, in that same TikTok I bought a pair of parachute pants. I accidentally called them cargo pants. They're actually parachute pants. I'm gonna bring them back and change them for the white. It's friends. I hope I'm saying that right. Anyway, isn't the pink adorable? Love them. And then I got this beautiful, this was giving me like fairy aesthetic. And um, this maxi skirt or midi skirt. Uh, I, what brand is it? You know, there's a brand in Urban Outfitters that is like the Urban Outfitters brand. Oh yeah, this is literally Urban Outfitters, the, the brand. And size medium, very cute. It has this beautiful tie. Um, yeah, really pretty. We love a midi maxi skirt. Cute. Wait, sorry, coming back to Revolve. We haven't talked about Harry Styles. Me and Sam went to see Harry Styles and this was the top I wore. Oh, it's so cute. So I found this on Revolve. What brand is this? Uh, what's the name of this brand? Oh, Super Down. Super Down, I got a size S and it's so cute. There was a few different colors. There was also pink, but I felt like doing blue for a switch up in my life. It just needed a bit of a change. And also the Santorini sunset. This, this outfit is literally the sunset in an outfit. So I had to photograph the outfit in front of the sunset. This, I love this outfit so much. Walking through Santorini, loads of girlies told me I look like a mermaid. People in Santorini are so nice. Like Santorini is just, you, you if you know, you know, you know I love it so much. I just, my heart is in Santorini and so many people said I look like a mermaid in this. People are so nice in Santorini. Like everyone's like, where'd you get your outfit? I love your, so cute. Everyone's, all the girls are just like loving each other's outfits and it's a good vibe. So that is also Revolve. What's the brand name of this? Oh, I can't read it. What's that say? Can't even remember. I'll leave it, I'll leave a link below. Oh, and then I've worn this in like three vlogs at this stage and I love it so much is this also revolve this mini dress and I wore it um, in like a hot pink back in February and I loved it so much so I had to get it in a baby pink for summer and I've been getting so much wear out of it. It's backless. I just, it's, it's a great repeat dress. I don't know, it just, it's just a beautiful dress and you, I'm just getting loads of wear out of it and I love it. So the gorgeous Annie Vintage sent me these, the cutest summer tops. Oh my God, I'm obsessed. Again, you might've seen these on my TikTok. I love Annie Vintage so much. I've actually placed a new order because I'm so obsessed. 
look how beautiful these tops are so this one has the ribbon no i'm obsessed and everything's so unique everything's so special all her pieces are just amazing so make sure to look at any vintage this is the first one i wore that out on the weekend with my girlies and then i can't wait to wear this one um hello and in the tiktok i wore this with like a little skirt so i haven't worn that outfit yet because i went for the other outfit so i can't wait to wear this one this is it's, it reminds me of like Desperate Housewives, like what Edie would wear with a little mini skirt and heels in Desperate Housewives, do you, if you know you know, do you know what I'm saying? So I can't wait to wear that again, probably a Lisbon outfit with my girlies. Oh, I'm also, I'm also going on a really exciting brand trip before Lisbon. I'm going to the US of A. I'm not going to say any more. Um, per. So maybe you'll see it then. You'll see all of it, but I don't know. Uh, yeah, pending. Purr. And this third little stunner. Oh, I love this one so much. I just love all of them. And I can't wait for my new order to arrive. I will show you. I'll probably do a little TikTok of when my new order arrives. I think I, I ordered three more pieces, two little tops, a gorgeous like Italian cardigan. Very exciting. Anyway, beautiful. Again, this is giving desperate housewives. Do you get the vibe? Do you know what I'm saying? And they're all a size small, I'm pretty sure, from any vintage website. So just for reference, I fit the smalls. Does that make sense? Oh my God, wow. I've realized that I like an, a low neckline. We've chatted here very honestly. We always talk about boobs here. And my boobs have definitely gotten bigger. Like, I think I've gone through a second puberty and obviously like lockdown weight. I also think the pill has made me gain weight. That's another topic of conversation girlies another day i think i'll do a whole video on it because i think i'm going to come off the pill and get the coil comment below if you have any recommendations or whatever or not recommendations but you know what i mean just like have you done that and did it work for you because i think i'm just done with the pill i think i'm over it it's been a few years and i just i'm sick I, i'm sick of it i feel like it's i'm not me i don't feel like me anymore but sorry i've shared very much that i'm really weird about my boobs and like weird about what i wear with my boobs or like i'll still i'll still wear like whatever but i'll probably be like oh i don't love that i don't like that i didn't mm. you know does that make sense we'll do a whole video about about the pill periods and boobs okay so anyway a low cut top though i do love Oversharing is what i do best no okay okay this we have to discuss this hope macaulay sent me gifted me i can't believe it these two insane pieces so i can't wait to wear these obviously this is a bit heavier so it'll probably be like a autumn spring thing for me it's a massive cardigan it is unreal isn't that insane like oh my god look at the colors it's so me those colors so beautiful it's amazing she's absolutely amazing and this adorable top isn't that so cute with the little skirt oh my goodness again the colors everything I hope macaulay does is oh to die for and um, i'm just obsessed and i love them so much so you'll probably see these on my tiktok i'll have to style them um obsessed oh my god they're so beautiful so thank you so much hope you are amazing girlies one really random thing my new favorite hair bands ever from claire's I'm obsessed with these and um, I just bought more. This is so random, but I'm just, you're gonna see a lot of these. You probably saw them in the vlogs while away. They're amazing while away. Are they not so cute? Like just so handy. I just love this. Like if you're just sick of your hair and you just wanna slick it back a bit, but like it makes it like really cute. Isn't it so cute? It's really 90s or something. Like we wore these in school. I don't know, I just love them. I thought, listen, I thought they were worth the mention. Oh, I've ruined my hair now. Oh. That's another thing, girls. I need to get my hair done, and I think I, I've apps. I've just ruined my hair. I think I might get um, girls. I'm thinking about getting a fringe. Is that absolutely wild? What have I done? What have I done? I liked how it was going. I liked how it was sitting. What have I done? What have I done? Okay. Anyway, that's how like fickle my hair is. It just touch it once, and it's like no, not today. I'm sweating. Okay, girlies, that is all for today. That is today's What's New My Wardrobe. I will see you next week for a new video. I love you so much. Thank you so much for watching. You know you mean the world to me. I'm just obsessed with you. I love you so much. And thank you always. So I'll see you next week. Love you. Bye.